there's always that element when you come into the gym that you want some competition. So we have something we call date and shooting. We have between 15, 20 to 25 parts of our offense or fundamentals that we really emphasize. And we kind of work within small groups, but within that small group, they're gonna execute the repetition and they're gonna either make the shot or miss it. When they make it, that's one in their pocket. And you can play the game to three, four or five, depending on who you are, or what you wanna do. But the minute that that player the first guy in that group makes the third one first, the fourth one first, or the fifth one, they win the spot. So in Dayton shooting, what we're introduced right now is what we call transition shooting. And if you're a coach or a manager or a player, you know, in some cases you'll need an extra guy. But if you're a high school coach, you're an AAU coach, and you're in a gym with two or three of your guys, to me, an element of competition you can bring to the table and devise your own drills to set it up, but you can also be incorporated in the group as a passer. This first thing that we're gonna show is transition shooting. You know, college basketball in general, but in some cases, high school basketball. The games are won, and the best shot you can shoot from three is the one that's early in transition. So for our players running hard and wide, Allen's gonna take off, your passer's gonna be right there, the pass is gonna come, and he's either gonna make the shot. So as a player, you're constantly, you know, on that move, but you're working that game rep and transition right now. So that's however many you know, they have. Ryan just made one, he's got one. Allen just shot, he, he made two. And let's say we're playing to three. If we're playing to three, it's on the player to really concentrate to be the first one to get that third make. And let's say Allen shot right there as his third one game, he won. In Dayton shooting sideline or transition shooting from three, Allen took the first repetition or our first breakdown and if we have five drills in transition or five drills off action or five drills off of what we would call triple threat, you can incorporate that menu to your workout. So say you come in and we're gonna work transition in half court, have those 10 opportunities for these guys to compete. Whatever you do on one side, you automatically compete on the other side. So we would go right sideline transition. Allen already has one win, go. One for Griff. Good, keep your count going. Simon, no good. Kevin's up, McFarland's up. I think Griff's the only one with a make. Good, we got Ryan with a make. Now we got Allen with one make. Who will get the three? That's what we're challenging our guys to do. Simon's got one. As a coach, you're really making them run and you're really making them communicate loud. The great thing about this stuff is you put pressure on your guys to go at game speed. No messing around. They come in for 45 to 50 minutes, the gun as your ultimate weapon with the rebound, passing and, and catching and moving and shooting. That's sideline transition shooting, and uh, that's a big part of how we play.